Hey guys, today I'm going to be looking at Structure Deck Matic. Pretty excited for this. I've uh, been looking forward to an English version of this deck ever since the Japanese one came out in about 2004. I got that years ago. I also thought it was an awesome deck. Obviously, I couldn't read the cards, so I was always hoping for an English one. This one didn't come out until 2010, six years later, so quite a weight but it's completely different anyway I've heard so looks like it comes with some special cards that you can't use not allowed in advanced format tournament play anyway let's open this up and take a look been waiting for this for a year and one nine years or something it's a shame they don't do the resealable boxes anymore I like to keep the boxes and put the cards back in once when I'm not using them. Right. It's a cool mat. It's kind of like the old original ones, but it's got Matic on it. That's pretty fancy. That's actually really nice. Five D's rule book and tips on how to play the deck and what you can expand it with. Although this was 2010, so I think I suggest on the back to get the Winged Dragon Aura because the Legendary Collection One was out at that time and Dark Arm Dragon was big back then. I think. Anyway. There's the cards. Oh, so exciting. I can open it. Come on. Lava Golem. Always been his main card. Come same as the Japanese deck. That's one of the only similarities between them. Even though when you summon it, it goes to your opponent's side of the field, so. Mystical Beast of Circuit. Yeah, this comes with three ultras, so it's pretty cool. Instead of the one ultra and two supers. And Temple of the Kings. I think those are two cards used by Odeon or something in the anime. Gilgarth, Mystic Tomato, Visor Dez, Legendary Fiend, Dark Jedoid, Eudoria, Gravekeeper's Spy, another one, Gravekeeper's Curse, Gravekeeper's Guard, another one, Gravekeeper's Spear Soldier, Grace. Keeper's Chief, Gravekeeper's Cannon Holder, Gravekeeper's Assailant, another one, Dralago, Bulgarian, Gravekeeper's Commandant, Gravekeeper's Visionary, Gravekeeper's Descendant, Mystical Space Typhoon, Nightmare Steel Cage, Creature Swap, Buka Moon, Dark Room of Nightmare, Necro Valley, another one, Foolish Burial, Magical Stone Excavation, A Leader of Darkness, oh that's a cool one to get, it's common. Acid Trap Hole, Mirror Force, that's nice. Skull Invitation, Coffin Sailor, Nightmare Wheel, Mirror Reflex Slime, Malevolent Catastrophe, and Dark Illusion. So, it's mainly just about. It's basically a Gravekeeper's deck, I guess. Probably throw in a few more sp uh, Gravekeeper specific spells and traps, which I'm probably going to do. That's a lot of nice cards. Comes as common. Allure of Darkness, another Mirror Force. Can't wait to try it out. And the three Ultras are nice. I'll show you, give you a quick look at the Japanese ones so you can see the difference. I'd really like to recreate this in English. Into the Japanese th tip thing, and that's one of the, the older style of mats, but in Japanese. 
Actually, I didn't realize that's cool. It's black as well instead of the brighter one version. Version 1.5 rulebook. Now we're on version 7. In that, I think we're maybe on version 8 now. Anyway, is that more cards? Yes. Damn, it's a lot more cards than the J Japanese one. I think the Japanese structure decks all came with an extra deck, an extra 15 cards. Anyway, Lab Golem. Oh, I'm not sure look at the list. Lab Golem, Humanoid, Humanoid Slime, Makira the Destructor, Revival Jam, Guardian Sphinx, Dark Jedoid, Eudoria. Hell Plumber, a Gravekeeper, 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 Ooh, Cat of Illumin, Owl of Luck, Cobra Jar, Spizer Shock, Drilago, Kunga, Boganian, Granadora, Visor Dez, and a Super Magic Stone Excavation, Mystical Space Typhoon, that's what the Japanese Monster Reborn looks like. Not as cool as the English one. Uh, jam, jam Breeding Machine. Card of Safe Return. Creature Swap. Dark Room of Nightmare. Stumbling. Nightmare Steel Cage. Spell of Pain. Male Ooh, Malevolent Catastrophe Super. Jam Defender. Mirror Force. That's crazy. The Japanese structure decks came with Metaphors from the beginning, it took like 10 years for us to start getting those commons in our decks. Uh, Reckless Greed, Coffin Sailor, Rise, Right of Spirit, Rope of Life, Nightmare Wheel, Last Trap Hole, Widespread Ruin, and this is the extra deck. Worm Drake, Giga, Gaga Gigo, man. Mother Grizzly, Wandering Mummy, Swarm of Locusts, Swarm of Scarabs, that Swarm of Locusts, Lord of Poison, Rush Recklessly, Infinite Cards, Pitamid Energy, Non Casting, Non Spell Casting Adia, Bombless Shifting Sand, Curse of Royal, Staunch Defender, and Compulsory Evacuation Device. So, as you can see, the decks are pretty much completely different basic general theme of gravekeepers I think this one's uh, supposed to be a lot more true to the, the anime so I'd really like to recreate this one in English just to see how good it is compared with this one the only tips it really gives you on the back is to add uh, Wing Dragon or Ra, so I'm hoping to get I'm gonna get in uh, two more boxes of War of the Giants. So hopefully I'll find one in there. If not, I'll just have to use my Illegal Ultra <laughs> instead. Anyway, that's cool. Been waiting for that one for a long time. Structure Dogmatic. So it was out in 2010, but it's getting harder and harder to find, so if you're interested in getting it, I'd get it now while it was only about £14 or something before it gets any any more expensive. No idea how much the Japanese one costs, but I wouldn't be surprised if it's getting up there more like 50 quid or more. I just picked up the Pegasus structure deck a few days ago because I found a few few cards from that line around. And it was what their people wanted, like a hundred dollars for an eBay, so that's mental. Anyway, really cool deck. Please like, subscribe, and check the description for links to my Facebook. And thanks for watching.